Hey guys, it's Flybox here, and people are stating that Roblox is bad. What on earth and why are people stating this? It makes no sense at all. But before we dive right into this interesting topic, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe button. Comment down below your favorite thing about Roblox. And with that out of the way, Let's hop right into it. What is Roblox? At the core, Roblox is an online game platform and game creation system developed by Roblox Corporation. It allows users to program games and play games created by other users, and pretty much creating this massive community within itself. This was released back in September in 2006, and quickly has became one of the biggest games online. As a lot of games like Minecraft and Fortnite, it competes with those, and even Steam as like the platform is having trouble competing with Roblox as Roblox has more players than Steam does on an average with one game, which is quite crazy how big and how far Roblox has come all this way. How could Roblox actually be bad? Well, when you take a look at it, a lot of people love Roblox. There genuinely is a cool idea behind it in the premise. The premise of being able to create your very own game and have players that are just like you play your game is absolutely cool. The fact that there's an entire currency within this world that you can actually earn money off of, yes, if that you didn't know, you can actually make money off of Roblox by creating games. But because of this, is all of this warranting it to actually be good or is it actually bad? The first problem we're going to take a look at with Roblox is actually going to be the moderation team. I think we can all understand and say within unison if you've ever played Roblox, the worst thing probably on there is going to have to be the moderation team. You can literally get banned for just saying one entire word. Literally, one of the biggest Roblox YouTubers, Flamingo, got banned about roughly a year ago for a few days just because he said one word in a jokey manner. And this happened to multiple people. It is completely outrageous what they do and honestly they need to change their system up because it's definitely not catching the right people. There are people on this platform that are stealing, that are doing worse things than just saying a single word. The next problem is probably going to be the chat filter. Obviously this is definitely one of those that everyone is kind of mixed about because the chat filter is there to help filter things that shouldn't be there. But one of the biggest problems is why should you have a chat filter if you can't even speak? When you try to speak to other players, you try to talk to them, your sentence gets blurred out because you said one word that the system thinks is completely wrong. When in matter, all you said was, hey, what's up? And suddenly all you said is, hey, up. Like, you can't speak to some people. It's really, really irritating and just makes the overall experience really, really horrible. Nextly, we have trolls. Obviously, if you've ever played on Roblox, this is one of the biggest issues as well. There are people who will try to to troll you and try to mess up your experience on the game. Now obviously this focuses a little bit more on the players than Roblox itself so I'll make it a little short. But honestly it still lies in fault with Roblox because of the fact that they allow this. Mentioned earlier with the Roblox moderation team, you can report people like this and half the time they won't get banned for what they do. But a lot of the time players will actually steal from other players or try to troll them and annoy them in ways that get them in trouble versus themselves. Which is super super irritating. And the last issue we're going to take a look at is the unwanted updates. With Roblox, they always come out with a ton of updates to the game that make it a lot better in some aspects. But sometimes we get these updates that are just completely irritating and just, why do we get these? We don't want them. Like, take for example, you know Roblox is the blocky game. But what if you took this blocky game and made it realistic? Well, they've been trying to do that for quite some time with updates coming out here and there. And honestly, it gets super irritating because if you lose that nostalgic value, it is going to be any good at all. But that's our video on why Roblox is actually not a bad game and why people are just saying it is. I don't know why people think that Roblox is such a bad game and gives it such a bad rep when in reality it's a really fun game. Anyways guys, if you did enjoy today's video, hit that like button and subscribe button. Comment down below your favorite thing about Roblox and we'll catch you all in another amazing and awesome video.